I'm 100% confident that this team will be here to stay in Calgary for the next 35 years. It took almost six months to get to this point, but at long last, an agreement has been officially signed to build a new arena in Calgary. Agreements like this are complicated. They're, they're large. Uh, there's a lot of paper that needs to get moved around between multiple parties. And so, uh, you know, in that agreement, we'd always said that if uh, all parties agree that a little bit more time is needed, they can take that time as defined by the collective group. Uh, that's what had happened. And this morning, they concluded that conversation. Back in July, City Council voted to front half the cost of a $550 million replacement for the aging Saddle Dome, which will be built here where there is now a parking lot. And it will be the centerpiece of a redeveloped Victoria Park. But the deal did come under fire from some, including a few dissenting councillors, over the use of public money. But supporters say that investment will be made back in spades. Far too often we see deals in other places for sports arenas that frankly do not deliver the benefit that is required for the public cost that's given. Ultimately, I think we've come to a fair deal uh, for Calgarians, but also a deal that isn't just about building an arena, but is in fact about creating a cornerstone for the revitalization of East Victoria Park and creating uh, more of a cultural and entertainment district for Calgarians. So ultimately, I think Calgarians will see serious benefit, not just financial, but also community benefit from uh, moving forward with this deal. Moving ahead, there will be some public engagement starting next month, while the Calgary Municipal Land Corporation takes the lead on design and development. They want to make it a true gathering place for year-round activities, concerts, retail and more, and it will fit with the expansion of the BMO Centre. We've done uh, collectively some amazing work over the last year and a half to make sure we truly understood the project and, and to ensure that we can be successful in delivering the project. Um, but the next step of actually getting the teams together and, and starting dealing with uh, the opportunity or the beast in front of us, is, uh, this, is, this is really the hard part. It also puts to bed any concerns the Flames will skip town as they will remain at the Dome during construction and stay here during the 35-year lease term. In a statement, the Flames say they now turn attention to the execution of the project and look forward to working with the city, CMLC and the Stampede as they begin to set out plans for the design and construction of the new event centre. In Calgary, Tom Ross, City News.